guys doing? This is another thing. Again, there's so much importance of so many uh, violations of satellite technology and dairy products and nutrition. You know, I have some chocolate milk in the refrigerator and it expires tonight. I mean, it, or it, the date's uh, the 17th, you know, it expires. And, uh, you know, now it's the 18th because it's after midnight. And the satellite man is still hitting me in the teeth and face and jaw. And I drank some of the milk. It doesn't expire right at midnight. Government dumbass. You don't understand the health industry, do you? Milk does not even start curdling at the end of the date. There's like a margin period of one or two days or three days or so. But I drank some of the milk before midnight and tasted fine. I drank a little after midnight on the today's date, which is still good, you know. But, you know, I'm not really going to drink any more of it. Not before, not tonight, really. But uh, I'm going to get some more milk, of course. But this government man claimed he thought if if a person's or if a person buys a gallon of milk and the date's the 17th and if it's 11.59 p.m. on that day, right before it turns the 18th, the satellite man thought he could murder people because they drank milk that expired that night. Like, I'd say if you drank it like one minute after midnight, this government man thought he could mutilate and murder and choke and hurt people's stomachs and be smacking them in their mouth. B, that's B period E period. You know, he thought he could just claim that he made his own rules inside other people's houses torturing and mutilating their teeth and faces when he thought he would nitpick on their life by illegally spying on them and terrorizing them and stalking them. The government satellite man needs to get ordered into court. Any politicians protecting the crimes of these satellite controllers, those people are subject to the penalties and lawsuits too.